day. I am going to Santa Monica by myself. I It's one of the last few days and I wanted to do something different out of the box. So I'm going to Santa Monica by myself. So I've got my whole bag packed. Here she is ready to go. And we are gonna get this journey started. Did I mention it's by myself? That's that's the big thing. So since the bus ride is so long, there's really not gonna be anything to show at that. So the next time you see me, I will be in Santa Monica. So. Oh my God. I'm in freaking Santa Monica. hours to get here so I'm going to enjoy every freaking minute that I have here I started out taking the bus and that worked out and then all of a sudden the guy was like last stop get off and I was like this is supposed to go all the way to Santa Monica and then it didn't and then I had to get an uber the rest of the way but I have made it I am here my plans for today lay on the beach go in the ocean go to the Brandy Melville store because I've never been and go to Earth Cafe because I've never been there either, and this will probably be my only chance to go. I can't believe I'm here. I can't believe I did this by myself. That's crazy. That's what gets me. feels so good to be out here as a pigeon. <laughs> super excited I'm one of those people who like likes to go to like the official store of places because I just think it's so cool because you don't get to have all these bougie stores that have their own place like on the west coast so that makes sense I think so oh my god I see you I'm about to go in I'm so excited <laughs> I didn't notice at first because it's so tiny or anything like that I just didn't find anything that I liked and in Brandy Melville it was actually like kind of crowded with people and I just was not in the mood to try stuff on there there were so many people Ugh. I also went into Forever 21 H&M and Urban Outfitters all were flops and I also like I'm at the end of my time here in Los Angeles so money is quite low so I really couldn't spend that much to begin with so it ended up working out I'm now on my walk towards Earth Cafe. What do you think? We're too obsessed with painting? I think so. Hmm, Buffalo's changed. Almost went to the wrong entrance. 
entrance over there, but we're going this way. Day two. It's super early in the morning. It's 7.54. It's not that bad. But me and Anne Marie, Celine's gone. She's left. <laughs> That's how I like explain it. Um, so there's this really cool cafe called the Griddle Cafe that makes really good, really big food, and we wanted to get it. So we we're super excited but this place gets really long line so you have to go early even on weekdays so it is tuesday morning we are up we are at it and we are going the other plan for today we are planning on doing the wisdom tree hike which i'm really excited for we have not decided on time but i think we're going to end up doing it later potentially at sunset time it's going to be really pretty i'm really excited for that that's it for today I'm gonna chill relax start packing which is crazy i can't believe it already um and sorry if this lighting is like dark i didn't want to be in like the sun because that's not great so so we're in the griddle cafe we're so excited we're looking at the menu now we're both deciding on pancakes because i mean if you're going to come to the griddle you're getting the pancakes they're massive so we're looking i think i'm leaning towards all about the base which is peanut butter cookie crunch and caramel filled with their banana nana inspired pancakes. I'm really excited for it. It's going to be massive. I'm going to have so many leftovers to last me the next few days. Trey excited. Oh, will you look at these pancakes? Look at my hand. <laughs> First of all, my hand. My hand. <laughs> like, it smells so good too. Oh she got a side of egg. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. god. <laughs> it's time going. to dive in. We're going. Where do I even cut? Like everywhere. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so good. Mm. I'm dying. I'm in heaven. Let's see what heaven tastes like. Bro, heaven. So it's a little later, as you can guess, I'm in my room. We got back maybe like two hours ago. I've just been chilling and editing, not anything really worth showing. We decided to push the hike to tonight just so that it would be a little cooler, not as hot, and we'll get the pretty sunset view that I was talking about earlier, hopefully. Um, so yes, I'm really excited for that. That is all that's on the agenda for today. It's good stuff, but nice and chill with long breaks in between. And now, the sad part, I need to start doing some packing. So that is what's next. I'm gonna start on the big one. Pack clothes I really haven't been wearing, like jeans and things like that, and then shoes, and move on from there. And I'm hoping to have just one suitcase packed today, and then pack the second one, maybe tomorrow night. I, oh, oh. The goal for today is the one big suitcase, so let's do that. Here she is, the big one. Whew. Okay. 
So we have got a lot of packing process going on. I actually ended up finishing packing the big suitcase and then I figured why stop there, keep going. I've packed this half of the suitcase completely. This one is my miscellaneous things. As you can tell, I've got like my Wii games, lights, things like that, decor wise. And then this is my carry-on that I'm working on slowly but surely. I still have laundry to do, but we're making progress in the bathroom as well. I'm sorting through all my makeup because I'm wearing makeup tomorrow the last day, so I'll be able to put this all away then. But I'm gonna get to start scrubbing and things like that, going through the drawers and emptying them, making sure there's nothing there. That's a box of tissues, but we're getting there. I'm like super sad about it, but I am almost completely packed already, minus the clothes that I need to wear each day and then like my facial stuff. So progress. And the hike is coming up soon as well, which I'm super excited about for the really cool pictures and stuff. Hopefully I don't die on it, we'll see. Yeah. That's so cool. This is the start of the trail, guys. <laughs> I can't wait to die! We're five minutes from the top. Woo! We're so out of breath, we want to die. <laughs> but look at this view. You're not even getting it. You're literally not getting it. Love you. Hug me. You did it. You did it. <laughs> you did it. <sighs> so apparently a thing they do here is people write in this like notebook thing about oh, all their multiple, adventures. There's a lot. And there's like many. And people just write that people came and everything about them. And it's so cool and they like it's just really exciting. We found the best one we think had. Reading by Anne Marie. Dear Wisdom Tree, bring me a big booty hoe for Christmas with a cute face. Follow me on IG. <laughs> and then he has his name. Ah, oh, he put it? That's amazing. <laughs> We just got to see the sunset. Literally, this GoPro does not do justice as to how beautiful it is, but we just got to see it go down, like just barely made it. It's beautiful. All my bags are packed right here, and my bedroom is completely empty. They're gonna be stripping the beds. I promise this is not going to get used by other people, but everything is completely empty and sad. I feel like I've said it in the past few videos, and I've even said it a few times in this video, but it is truly, I truly, truly, truly feel blessed to have been able to do this, to be out here, the people I met, the things that I did every place that I got to go to and even though there were still some more places I wanted to go to I know I'm going to come back here hopefully next summer I hopefully get to do this again I love LA so much I can't wait to move out here I know that this is the place for me a hundred percent in my heart that I belong here this is the place for me and it's such like a crazy thing to think that in two years time 
I will be living here. I'm not emotional, I'm just like a slight tear. But, so, that is going to be the end of this vlog because you guys don't want to see the airport. That's not exciting. If you guys liked this video and you liked watching me, then you should press that subscribe button down below. It would mean so much. And I will see you guys in next week's video. Bye.